All right, we're back out. It's Veterans Day. We are at a Little League baseball field. It's been around since the late 1930s, 1940s. Uh, got my little helpers here again with me today. Got my son Liam, my daughter Summer. And uh, I found a few Wheaties here before when the ground was extremely rock hard. Uh, right in this area right here. So I figure now that the ground is a lot more wet, uh, who knows, maybe I'll get deeper and find something better. So if we find something good, we'll get back. We dug real deep. About eight inches down. About eight inches down. And this and is what we came up with. This is what we came up with. Our second dime of the day. Second dime of the day. 1981. 1981. We're going to keep looking for the silver. We're going to keep looking for the silver. And we'll get back to you when we find something. We'll get back to you when we find them. Bye. Bye. All right, we had another eight inch signal here. My son is checking it out. What do we got, pal? A weedy. Do we got a weedy? Yep. All right, man. What year is it? Clean it off when we get home. You're going to clean off when we get home? All right, let me take a look and see if we can. I could probably do it. All right, let's see here. It is a little dirty. I could clean it off. I know how to clean it. Let's take a look at it, and uh, I'll get back with you when I see what a date. All right, trying to check this out here in the sun. Oh, the sun's going in as I try to point it on there. It looks like it's either, I'm almost positive, it's a 1916 Wheat Penny. So that's a pretty good age one. Uh, I don't see any mint mark on it, but we got it home, get it cleaned up, see what we got. Do we find anything else? Yeah. We'll get back with you. All right, we're gonna video a full dig here on this one. Solid penny to dime signal. It's four to six inches down. Let's see what uh, we get here. See the ground is nice and wet here. There we go. It looks like nothing more than a very badly eaten zincon. Find anything else? We'll get back. You on? Yep. All right, so. Digging a, I don't know, fairly deep, came up with another bottle cap. It was a coin signal, as always. But what else we found in that hole? Is another first for me is a marble. Uh, I haven't found one of them yet. I know a lot of other people have. Uh, let me show that to you a little bit later and get it signed. It's kind of heavy. It's definitely glass. It looks like it's got either markings in it or I don't know. Once you get it cleaned up, though, we'll show it to you until we find something else. Bye. Uh, well, back from our uh, little hunt at the baseball field, and uh, we ended up with uh, three quarters, two dimes, three pennies pre-1982, and then eight zinkins, you know, 1983 or nowhere, that were very, very eaten up. Um, also, we have the weedy. That's the only one weedy we found, the only old coin. It is a 1946, not a 1916. Still kind of hard to read. I don't know how much on there you can see. Um, but that's what we found old coin wise, uh, definitely a, a weedy, but, um, the only other thing we found other than the trash that I threw out was this marble, uh, it's a nice size marble and it's bigger than what I used to play with when I was younger. Uh, it's completely clear. It does have a, a couple of, um, lines in them. They don't look like scratches. They look like they were there when it was made, so I don't know how old the marble is, and I'm sure there's no way to date it. But, uh, neat find nonetheless. You know, first time I found a marble. I know a lot of other people on the forums have. Um, but that's it, and uh, hopefully if I get lucky, I can get out again this weekend 
and um, get out to uh, the uh, home site that I was checking out before. Uh, so when I get there, uh, bring you back on. Once again, thanks for watching, Jersey Digger, and um, subscribe if you can. Bye.